A pleasure to me all at last, and welcome back to Nerf Secret Reveal Distance Gauge Part 2. And for today's presentation, we have ourselves a Dartag blaster known by the name of the Speedload 6. Now this blaster is basically one of the smaller scale versions, or at least the medium scale versions, when in comparison to a good majority of the 2011 edition of the Dartag line. Being the second iteration of Dartag that Hasbro had ever made, it does make sense that they basically pay a little homage to the N-Strike series by utilizing their color schemes of yellow and black with some orange features, as well as gray, just for accenting. But today it's time that we get to the test here by using the Speedload 6 on a 100 foot long meter that is basically gonna be the source of some hopefully exciting results. Well, that last one jammed, but let's just see what we got here. In terms of results, I'm kind of expecting some pretty decent ones at least. The first one we're going to count at 25 feet because it landed just above it. Then with a good solid majority of the middle section that we could see up here, we're likely to call the spot at 33 feet. And then the top shot shows 34 to 35. So what I'm seeing here is a bit of a pattern for the most part. Some blasters do good, some do not. And I feel like that it's only a fair estimate that only some blasters might actually do better. But for 35 feet, for the time at least, this blaster probably was all right. Yet it would make sense if it were even better. So whether by pure example or by just simply knowing the fact that the speed load itself probably wouldn't be the best recommended choice possible for any Nerf war these days at least. It's still worth noting that over 10 years ago when this was new, it did set up quite a bit of an impression. It really is quite a shame that Hasbro has never released a third Dartag series like they probably should have. In any case though, I'm not really gonna argue or try to deep dive into these controversies how could I, basically? But if you want to see more, go down on my channel to make sure that you like, subscribe, comment, follow me on social media, and stay on the Hollywood side.